Hey everyone, I'm Rodev here, and in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a uh, script that will allow you to set teams for players of certain uh, ranks in your group. So let's get right into it. So the first thing you want to do, you guys probably already have your teams made, but I'm just going to quickly make mine. So I'm going to go to teams and then hit plus and create my first one. This one I'm going to call uh, red team, and I'm going to be setting the color to red. And then I'm going to make another one called uh, blue team. And I'll be setting the color to blue. And uh, with these two teams, what I'm going to be doing is creating a script that will set the player uh, on these uh, different teams. So the first thing you want to do is actually turn off auto assignable on both of the teams. And once you've turned off auto assignable, you can go to server script service, click plus and insert a script. And if you don't see the explorer and properties window, go to view and make sure you turn them both on. Once you have that done, go back to home. Now once you uh, are on the script, you want to go to name and you want to call it uh, group rank team script the name really doesn't matter I'm just gonna be calling it that and the first thing you want to do is get teams service so we're gonna do local uh, teams equals game we'll get service teams just like that and once you've done that the next thing you want to get is uh, probably just player service so local players equals game colon get service players and then I'll uh, get rid of that if you have that and the next thing you need to do is go ahead and create a function so local player added equals function uh, just like that you can also do local function player added just like that they both kind of do the same thing all right guys one thing i did forget is to you need to add a player right here just like that you want to type player and once you've done that the next thing you want to do is go ahead and grab their group rank so local uh, player rank we can say equals player colon get rank in group just oh you guys don't have to do this but I'm gonna be doing it I'm gonna type player over here and then with that what I can do is right get rank in group and then right here you need to put your group ID so to get your group ID you need to go to your group and then there will be a few numbers in the URL bar there's gonna be a screenshot on your screen right now and you just need to copy these numbers and paste them in here so for example, I'm just going to put in a few zeros, and then after that, you can go to the next line. And then what we can do is, if player rank is, uh, let's say you want to do a greater than or equal to, then we could do, if it's greater than or equal to 10, so for every number, including 10, for so for every number above 10, including 10 itself, it's going to give the player this team. For that, all you have to do is player.team equals teams, colon, uh, find first child and then you can put the name of the team right here so red team so if uh in this group right here say my rank was 10 or above i would i would be on red team you guys can also do equals equals this basically means if the player rank is 10 so not above not below but if it's 10 it'll give them red team and uh say uh you want to do a 10 or less then you do like this and basically just get rid of these okay so this is a less than sign this is an equal sign so if the player rank is less than or equal to 10 that means 10 or anything below that it'll give the player a red team and you want if you want to do more of these and uh, do it for more teams do it like this and then you could do uh, something else so make sure these numbers aren't the same so this one can be 11 so if it's greater than or equal to 11 then it's red team if it's uh, less than or equal to 10 then it's uh, I'll say something like blue team. But yeah, it's basically how you make the script that will set the player um, rank. One thing I did forget that's really important is you need to connect the function. So players dot player added colon connect uh, player added, just like this. This will basically make it so when a player joins the game, it actually runs the function, and you don't actually need uh, this right here. Yeah, it's basically the finished script. Make sure you put your group ID right there, and then uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Make sure you type your team names out correctly and disable the auto assignable property for all of the teams and make sure the team colors are different. So yeah, other than that guys, make sure you leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And uh, yeah, join the Discord server if you have any uh, issues that you need help with uh, and you can DM me, you know, ping me, any of that if you need help. But other than that, make sure you uh, leave a like, comment, and subscribe. See you guys in the next one. Peace.